Hey ladies, welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel if you're a returning subscriber. Anyway, I am on here today to do a huge product review for you ladies. I have a bunch of new products that I want to just quickly review. Um, I am, I've gotten a lot this month, like crazy for some reason, like I went on a makeup spree. <laughs> I don't know, I guess, I guess, I don't know, but, um, I was super excited about all the makeup I got, so this is what's gonna start, and I have it all, like, kind of spaced out with lips and stuff like that, so we'll start with the first product that you normally put on your face, and it would be from my Ipsy bag, the Pore Professional from Benefit, uh, primer that they gave, um, it's a little sample, like, little sample. Um, now, I like this. This is good. I'm not saying it's bad. I'm saying it's good. It's, it works. It does what primer needs to do. But honestly, there's nothing like, woohoo, about it. I actually kind of really just prefer the hard candy primer. Um, the ultralight formula. I actually just prefer that. It does just the same. It holds on my makeup just as long. Um, and this feels... I, I have to use more product to cover the areas. This I actually have to use like a dollop of it. Um, so that's like nothing. Um, so I don't know. Kind of preferring the hard candy one because this it works. I'm saying it works, but honestly, I'm not spending that kind of money just when I can have a drugstore that does just the same. So, and then uh, next thing you would put on your face really would be um, uh, foundation. But my foundation that I got my um, my Fit Me. Uh, poreless from Maybelline. I got the 110 in porcelain. Honestly, ladies, I got the wrong color. Um, I have been using bronzer upon bronzer upon bronzer just to make my face look not white, like paper white. So I got the wrong. Now, I love this. Love it. But um, I got the wrong color, so I need to get the right color and then fully do a review for you ladies. So we're going to go on to like eyeshadows and eyes. So I finally found uh, my creme brulee that I got like a couple of Dollar Tree hauls ago. <laughs> um, I finally found it. I thought my daughter lost it. I have just now gotten back into this and I am loving it. Um, it's like a cream matte and it is just gorgeous ladies. It is just like a just just gorgeous it's just plain like skin tone color you can totally um use this all over your base and everything um it is a very good dupe um well i wouldn't say it's dupe well i don't know i haven't really tried i haven't really tested it i could try though ha! let's see <laughs> so i got the kat von d palette as you saw in my stacy welcome to stacyville <laughs> as I would say, when she came to my house, um, and we went shopping. So I got the Kat Von D palette, and I've been using it every day since. Like, I can't stop using this palette. I'm in love with it. Um, so these are the colors. It's really great. It's a really great palette. Um, I am excited about all the colors. And today I have, like, the plums on, and they're still, like... Fantastic. I put it on earlier this morning and it's still fantastic. So I'm actually going to do a little swatchy of this color right here. And let's see. Ooh. Okay, no, it's not a dupe. <laughs> okay, not a dupe. But, so that's the Kat Von D, the whiter version. And then this is like a pinky uh, skin tone version more. But I am loving the feel of these, though. These are creamy, soft. Like, if you can find this at your Marshalls, ladies, for $20, pick it up. Uh, we picked it up because we were just freaking out about it. But I'm extremely excited with my purchase. Um, 
this is like one of the greatest palettes besides my Too Faced Love palette. They're creamy, extremely easy to put where you want to put them. Anyway, let's continue. <laughs> before I like go off topic too much. Okay, and the next thing would be from another thing for my Ipsy bag, the Eco London Skinny Liquid Black Eyeliner. I am loving this, loving it, loving it. Uh, it is very nice, very nice. It is better, I would say, than my C-I-A-T-E London Fierce Fleeks that I got from my Ipsy bag. But see, I got a lot more than this one. Um, so if I'm just running real quick, I'll put this one on. But if I'm going somewhere that I want my makeup to stay a lot longer, this one stays a lot longer than this one does. I'm going to tell you that right now. Um, so, and then I... Stacy gave me a little, like... Oh, well, I won one of her giveaways, which was just hilarious because that was funny. But it was one of her small Instagram giveaways. So um, she gave me the bag instead of shipping it to me. Um, so she gave me the LA Colors Curve Wowie Lash. This comes with the Dollar Tree. And I have been using it. And I actually like it. Look at that curved brush. Tell me that's not weird. That's weird, but honestly, it's really good. Um, for a dollar, it's insanity. Um, like all these dollar things are insane to me right now. Um, this is this is fabulous. It stays on, it curls, it gives you massive lashes. It's pretty awesome. Um, I highly recommend it for a dollar. You can find it at your Dollar Tree, you can find it at Dollar General, Family Dollar, all for a buck. Very good. Um, I also got in that uh, giveaway little thing, I got a Revlon Color Stay uh, Cream Gel Eyeliner, 24 hours crayon, brush included, and it is in the color Plum. So this is what the packaging looks like. It is a very purple color. Let me take it out for you ladies. Is it a very, very purple color? And I have it on my eyes today, and it's still there. Yep, still there. Still very uh, pigmented. Still very nice and bright, and I didn't even set it. I wanted to see how it would last. So this is the brush it comes with. Just comes off the top, and then you just dip it in here. And let me get a swatchy for you ladies. So that's just one stroke of the brush right there, which is awesome. I feel like it is it is super creamy um, it stays where you want it to stay it's still there like I I haven't I don't have any kind of movement of my makeup today I'm sorry I'm just really and the only thing I had to reply was my uh, I don't or my lip gloss my lipstick jeez I can't even speak <laughs> all right and so the next thing on your face would be like blushes and bronzers and highlighters. So the blush I got in my Ipsy bag is the Douchey or Deuce, Deuce, D-O-C-C-E. Um, and this is the color. Let me see if I can. Swatchy, swatchy. I know, I'm hoping you can see these swatches. I'm doing this at 11 o'clock at night when I'm actually baking my Thanksgiving dinner right now. <laughs> Me and my husband are baking my Thanksgiving dinner that we're taking to my mom's. So there's the blush right there on my wrist kind of area. It is very pretty, um, pretty awesome, pretty color. Can't go wrong. It's, that's it. It's a matte color. It really works for my skin tone. The next blush would be, um, the Wet n Wild Color Icon Mellow Wine. Very pretty. Very creamy. Super creamy. These colors, actually, are so close, it's insane. Um, I have tried to do, um, I almost want to say, no, okay. So the Color Icon has a more of, tiny bit of more of a pink tone. Uh, the Deuce has a orangey tone, um, but they're, they're still, they're, they're 100, they're awesome. This was $3 at Walmart, hello. Um, 
And then also in my, uh, that giveaway, um, Stacy also gave me the Vintage by Jessica, uh, highlight. And it is in the color Crystal Pink. It is a lumin Illuminating Face Highlighter. Super pretty. This is the first time I've ever used highlighter, ladies. And this is gorgeous. Like, holy crap. Like, you would ne- I would never- I want to try, like, white highlighters now. Like, a white highlighter that people are talking about. But there's the pink one. I really hope you can see these. Alright, that is- that is freaking awesome. Um, the payout is amazing. It stayed- Mm, it's kind of still on there. I'm not saying it's like 100%, but I kind of have touched my face since I've talked about it. And then also in my recent Dollar Tree haul, I found a bronzer. Hello from Beauty Benefits Bronzer. It is freaking amazing. Another dollar. Hello. Let's get a swatchy swatchy. Can you see that? Like, that is just amazing. Ladies, look at that. Look at that. That is amazing. I have actually been using, as you can tell uh, in a few of my videos, I've been using the NYC Sunny Bronzer, and that has more payout than this. Like, I'll show you. Like, you can't even see that one. You can't even see that. I'm trying to build it up for you. Look at that. It, it's it's nothing. It's it's there's no payout to this, and I'm super excited. That's a dollar. Are you kidding me? Raise the roof. Okay, and then also in the uh, giveaway that she gave me, I got the Milani. It's it's new Milani Power Up. What is this? Uh, lip gloss and stain. It's a two in one. So lip gloss and stain. And it's in the color Raspberry Tart, which is number three, I guess. Um, but it's the Milani Power Up. Now, this is good. The color payout, amazing. It's got its own brush included. The color payout is amazing, but it is kind of cakey. Um, so it, it, it feels weird when you first put it on. I'm going to tell you that right now. It feels real cakey. It feels real sticky. But as soon as it dries, nothing. It's it's great. It's fabulous. So I do have to give it like a thumbs up. But just the first like 10-15 minutes of you talking, your like lips are all kind of yeah, yeah, yeah. So I don't like it. But it works. It works. It works. So I love the color too. It's a very, very berry tone. It's super cute. So, all right. And the next thing uh, would be, I got in with the Kat Von D, I got it at Marshall's uh, for $1.50. I got a Milani lip gloss, and I'm not really sure the color, I think the sticker got pulled off. Um, but it's like a, it looked kind of like a red pink, um, but it's not. It's like a corally pink. So, there's the color right there. It's, it's actually really good. It, it, for a lip gloss, it stays glossy even when it's dry. It's awesome. I definitely thumbs up this too. And going on to my Ipsy bag, I got a matte lip or matte stick from Absolute New York. And it is in the color dark red. So it's like that. It's flat. Ah, I'm running out of spaces for a swatchy. Okay, it's right there. So the color payout is amazing. It is a red, but it, it like when you wear it, it's more of like a pinky red. So it's not like a bright red, but it's more of a pinky red. It's actually doable. It's very nice, very awesome. I totally am loving this too. I think my monthly favorites is going to be like, Mind blowing, I swear. <laughs> um, and also, um, I got a e.l.f. Uh, lip color in wine recently in my Walmart haul. And it's a crayon. We'll go over here. 
It kind of reminds me... No. It's, it's actually berry instead of a red. Um, it's a very berry. But my... One of the girls I follow... Um, Emily. Uh, I will leave her link down below. Uh, she used this color in one of her Snapchats and took a picture of it. And I was like, hello. Gotta try. It's $3. Not that bad. <laughs> so, I'm excited about it. And then the last, um, oh no, not the last thing, but the last two lippies I got from Stacy. She's awesome. She gave me two Smashbox lipsticks. Um, so I got Action, which is like a pinky. And these are just the B, um, Legendary Lipsticks. Uh, one swipe color doesn't say anything like it's just laction. Yeah, this is called action and It is a like pinky tone It's like a pinkily pinkly pinkily. It's like a pinkily pink purple it's very pretty and it is like amazing. I'm wearing it in the middle of my lips today and I love it. I'm not sure about it like alone yet. Um, when I tried it alone it just kind of washed out my face a little bit because I think it's too light but we'll see from there. Um, but I like it in the middle. Um, I've also I also paired it with the other one that she gave me which is vinyl from Smashbox. Same line, same packaging. Look at this packaging. It's just gorgeous. And then this is like a bear. It's like a purple, ladies. See? We're next to each other. It is a purple. And it is pretty pigmented for being such a dark color. I love it. Um, when I wear it alone and um, I when I wore it the first night we went to dinner and I was like actually really liking the way it was even coming off like the way it was um, dying off it turned into like this pink in the middle it was really pretty um, and one of the final things I have for you is my also for my ipsy bag uh the n-u-x-e paris detox um for youth and anti-aging care it's a night cream um i had to look into it um because everything on the back here is in paris is in paris is in is in french so it is a night cream and i've never used a night cream before but this stuff is flipping the bomb like it will make you not look like you're tired at all when you wake up it's amazing. It's amazing. I have no idea how much it is. I will leave it link up here somewhere on how much it is because I know this is a sample size. It's 0.5 ounces, but I have no idea how much it is. I got to figure out how much that is. And then the last thing, uh, also what I got in my, uh, Dollar Tree haul, one of my last Dollar Tree hauls, um, I got the wet and wild under the sheets. Um, I did a review when I got them because I used them like once. But now I have a little bit more of a better review on them. I like them. Not in love with them, but I like them. They're worth the dollar. I'm going to tell you that right now. They're definitely worth the dollar. But they're really only worth taking off, like, lipstick, um, swatches, um, not your full face. Because as soon as you go into, like, eyeliner, it goes... All over your face like all of a sudden you're you're on the other side and you got a black mark streak all across your forehead it's insane but they're worth the dollar for taking off like swatches and stuff like that and cleaning up like your brushes for a quick little swab um, so I'll continue to buy them when I see them for the dollar um, just to have them but I'm not there I'm not saying that they're 100% take off all your makeup with them so, but in my Dollar Tree haul, I recently got these, and I have not tried these yet, so, um, I'll give you a review of these later on, but, um, those were new at my Dollar Tree. There, there was 40 of them. 
I am, I was pretty much done anyway. Um, so I hope you ladies enjoyed the video. And I will be getting into some stuff. I'll show you my favorites. I'll probably narrow down a little bit of it. <laughs> because I like gotta narrow it down. Anyway, um, I hope you ladies enjoy and I hope to have a holiday giveaway coming up soon. Um, I'm not sure exactly what I'm gonna give away yet, but I hope to be hitting up the Black Friday deals to see what I can get for you ladies. Anyway, I hope you ladies enjoy and I will see you in my next video. Bye!